Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. Let's continue our lesson in lecture 4 of 9. Now let's look at the examples on how to find one of the functions when the composite and the other functions are given. Example 4. Given the function fx equals 2x squared plus 3x minus 1, for x greater than n equals to negative 3 over 2, find the function gx if fgx equals 2 to x plus 3. So for this example, it gives you the composite function and fx, only one function. For function fx, for quadratic function, we give you in general form. First, we can change it into standard form. Standard form, the quadratic will be x plus 3 over 2 square minus 13 over 4. You can refer how to change the form in quadratic function characteristic. Okay, now let's proceed the solution for the question. fgx equals to 2x plus 3. In the question, it gives you the function of f, that is x plus 3 over 2, square minus 13 over 4. We can compare these two functions. So both actually from the function f. We can compare these two. We can substitute gx into x. Let's look for the calculation. gx plus 3 over 2 square minus 13 over 4 is equal to 2x plus 3. Simplify so that we can get the value of x, 2x plus 19 over 2 on the right side. Square root plus minus 2x plus 19 over 2. So now we get gx equals to plus minus 2x plus 19 over 2 minus 3 over 2. If you refer back to the question, it gives you the condition for x. x must be greater than negative 3 over 2. So that's why we only take the positive set. Because x is greater than equals to negative 3 over 2, gx is equals to positive set 2x plus 19 over 2 minus 3 over 2. So this is the answer. Example 5. Given that fx equals to 2x plus 3 and fgx equals to 10x minus 9. Find gx. fx equals 2 to x minus 3 is already given in the question. And fgx equals to 10x minus 9. So, if we look at these two functions, both are actually function f. For the first function, we can substitute any value into x. Let's say if we want to find F2, so we substitute 2 in X. So now we want to substitute GX into the function F. So it will be 2GX plus 3 equals to 10X minus 9. Now simplify so that GX will be the subject matter. 2gx equals to 10x minus 9 minus 3. 
you will get gx equals 2, then x minus 12 over 2. Both term can be divided by 2. You will have 5x minus 6. Given gx equals to set x plus 4 and gfx equals to x plus 2, find fx. gx equals to set x plus 4 and gfx equals to x plus 2. Like the previous example, both function actually is function g. So we can substitute fx into x. fx plus 4 equals to x plus 2. After that, we have fx plus 4 equals to x plus 2 square. And finally, the answer is x plus 2 square minus 4. Example 7, if gx equals 2 to x plus 3 and fgx equals 2, then x minus 9, find fx. Both of this function okay, are different because the first one is gx, the second one is actually function f. This one is function G, and this one is function F. What we can do here is substitute GX into function F. So function F to X plus 3 is equals to 10X minus 9. When we have this statement, we still cannot find the value of x because in the bracket we have two term because it is two terms we have to use substitution let u equals to 2x plus 3 from u you can find x equals to u minus 3 over 2 both of this value we want to substitute into x we want to substitute u we want to substitute here and x we want to substitute here so that we can get the function all in term of u f u is equals to 10 x is equals to u minus 3 over 2 we got all terms in the function in u Simplify, you get 5u minus 3 minus 9. So, fu is equals to 5u minus 15 minus 9 is equals to 5u minus 24. Don't forget to substitute back your fu to fx. fx is equals to 5x minus 24. So, this is your answer. Example 8. If fgx equals to fx square minus 2x plus 1 and gx equals to 2x plus 1. First, we want to find gfx. In the question, it gives us fgx and gx. There is two different function. One is f and one is g. If it is different, so we have to use substitution method. How we want to use substitution method? First, substitute g into f. We use substitution method so that all terms in f will be in term of u. u is equals to 2x plus 1. We take the element in the bracket. So x is equals to u minus 1 over 2. 
we want to substitute u in the bracket and x in these two terms. f u is equals to 4 u minus 1 over 2 square minus 2 multiply with u minus 1 over 2 plus 1. Okay, simplify all the terms. You will get 4 multiply with u square minus 2u minus plus 1 over 4 minus, we can cancel 2, minus u plus 1 plus 1. 4 divided by 4 is equals to 1. You will have u square minus 3u plus 3. Don't forget to change back to x. So your last answer will be fx equals to x square minus 3x plus 3. After we get function fx equals to x square minus 3x plus 3, now let's find gfx gfx is equals to gx square minus 3x plus 3. Substitute into g, it will be 2x square minus 3x plus 3 plus 1. Open the bracket, it will be 2x square minus 6x plus 6 plus 1. This is the answer for gfx. Subsequently, find the value of x that satisfy fgx equals to gfx. Okay, we have to equate these two composite function. 4x square minus 2x plus 1 equals to 2x square minus 6x plus 7. Simplify. You will get 2x square plus 4x minus 6. All term can be divided with 2. x square plus 2x minus 3 equals to 0. Now we can factorize the quadratic equation. x plus 3 multiply with x minus 1. You have two values of x. x equals to negative 3 and x equals to 1.